So, um, and this is something that uh, I have to express my gratitude to Chad Zimpson because Chad was uh, really uh, the person who came up with this idea. Uh, we start to talk about this possibility more than one and a half years ago. And then uh, we make uh, concrete progresses in direction. And what you will hear to now is really the uh, full program of uh, the master. And really, I had a very, very uh, fruitful uh, uh, collaboration with the DIU University. Let me say, I found a really an incredible appropriate environment for uh, high level teaching activities uh, that uh, confirm me the quite good idea of a chaff to move to this uh, master of uh, multiple sclerosis. The European Chaco Foundation is of course deeply in the area of uh, education. Uh, I think you know that we organize more than 10 workshop plus very special uh, meetings in, uh, with the educational uh, aim for uh, uh, multiple sclerosis worldwide, from China to South America, to North America, to Panara countries, to Europe. So this is a bit the uh, tip uh, of the quality of the iceberg of the education traditionally. So I'm really personally very proud to be part of this uh, specific action of the European Chaco Foundation. Uh, we met many times with the uh, in scientific committee that you will see in a minute. And we uh, met a lot of times with the, org the organization team in uh, Dresden. And uh, really, um, it was a very uh, quite good uh, progression and, and final results are very exciting for me. Uh, having said that, I just mentioned Chaff as the one who did everything uh, in order to promote uh, this action. And I would like to ask now Chaff to go a bit more in detail about how we come up with this decision, how you come up in, initially with this idea, and now we are really able to, uh, to, to, to start this type of initiative. Chaff? Yeah. Yeah, thank you very much, Giancarlo. So I, I think it's for me, uh, it's a pleasure to, um, yeah, to give the compliments back to you, Giancarlo. Um, I think it's uh, really great that European Chaco Foundation as the best institution, I think, for MS education is there. And um, I think to really ge get the best speakers and the specialists in the field of multiple sclerosis, I think European Chaco Foundation, of course, the president, I think it's crucial. So I would like to give a little bit um, um, the history, um, how we came up with the idea. Um, so probably the idea to have a master's, uh, um, a master's study program for one disease started already five, uh, five, four or five years ago when we sit together with the colleagues um, of the um, Dresden International um, University and, and then we had the idea um, to set something up in, 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 in German, in the German language. So you can see on the, on the, um, on the, on the photograph, um, you can see Judith Haas, who is um, sharing the um, German MS patient organization, um, Professor Funk, president of DIU. You will, you will, um, you will uh, present the uh, DIU a minute later. So that was the start point when we developed this concept to have an, um, to have a German course, um, a German master course on MS management. So on the next slide we can see, um, 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 so we can see here you, you, you can recognize how it, how it, uh, how long it took. And for the German course, so we had, we had, uh, we started in, in 2018 to write really um, 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 a program. Then we had to implement it. We had to um, um, we had to get, uh, of course, a certificate. So every study course has, of course, to be approved by the by the German government. And then, um, um, then now, nearly two years ago, we had the first um, matricle, so the first course 
And now we have a second one, which is which uh, just has uh, have started. And although we had, so here you can see from last weekend, um, our students in Göttingen who did neuropathology. Um, um, so we <laughs> nice. saw in in Germany that it that it went very well, and um, we we have a group which is typical for the DIU um, um, classes of around 20 students. So you don't have more students because it's very important to have really um, a, a high quality um, educational um, experience. And we have a mix, same what is a little bit planned for um, for the international Charcot uh, masters. Um, and we plan a mix of, of, of dig digital lectures and of uh, presence weekends. So here you can see um, the data from the German course so it's four semesters, two year, you do it uh, while you are working. Um, so we have mainly digital courses and um, on-site appointments, including conferences like, um, like Actrums. And um, so what is necessary, and that's quite comparable for the, um, for the um, international Charcot masters. So you have to have a university degree and um, education in a health pro uh, profession and experience in, in, in health. And you can see here that you get um, a master's of science or um, 60 ECTS points. So next um, slide, please. Um, so, um, so what is the program in Germany when we have started, what was it aimed at? So we, of course, mainly physicians, but therapists, um, nursing staff and scientists as well. And, we have, for example, in the first and in the second matricule, we have not only physicians, but we have scientists and therapists who are really interested to be um, um, to be um, uh, to be um, um, yeah, specialized in the field. And you can see here the composition of our first um, German speaking course. You can see, of course, we have a lot of um, neurologists there, but we have uh, two biologists as well, and it's possible for them to follow um, um, this course as well. So that we have now demonstrated um, in, 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 in Germany, now with two courses coming up, that in principle, um, um, it's, it's an interesting concept. It's very helpful for, um, for doctors because uh, to be specialized in MS, you have, of course, the alternative to go to, um, to a center which is specialized in multiple sclerosis, but even then it's quite hard to get all training done in a, in a really uh, independent and high quality way. And that is a way of how we um, teach um, multiple sclerosis. So we have six modules, theory, clinical diagnostics uh, aspect, and a very important module teaching you in studies and statistics. And then we have um, three um, other big modules, so therapy one, it's the disease modulating, uh, disease modifying therapy, progression modifying therapy, then um, therapy two, it's the symptomatic treatment, rehabilitation, palliative medicine, and then at the end, monitoring and documentation, putting everything into context. And that is that is a complex, um, um, of course, schedule of, uh, of uh, lectures and hands-on trainings. Yeah, and that's um, after we have had this positive experience from Germany, um, so I can I remember very well when I wrote my email to Giancarlo and when we when we had the, the our first phone conferences when he when he came to Dresden and um, I think it's really Giancarlo who brought this idea to um, ECF uh, executive board, um, which I think it's very important that you get really the uh, the the uh, a significant MS community leading MS community and um, you get them part. Uh, being part of this idea to have an international master's in multiple sclerosis. And that's why I think I've shown a little bit um, how it's um, um, how it uh, how has been our first experience in Germany. I think it was helpful to, to have an idea uh, about this. But now, of course, we can go for the second level and, of course, with, with, uh, with a uh, lecturer audience, which is which is remarkable. Here you can see what we have. We have different kinds of um, teaching and learning uh, uh, formats, lectures, tutorial, experts discussions, case conferences, journal clubs, 
but of course, which is very important, hospitation, so to go into MS centers to learn there directly and excursions, so to participate um, supervised in the in the in the conferences. So that's for example here an example for an um, uh, for an on clinical visit, so which happened um, a week ago in Göttingen. So Göttingen is our capital for neuropathology of MS with Christine Stadelmann. But pediatric MS is very much uh, research is there as well. That's why we combine pediatric research and uh, neuropathology there. And um, you can see here that was a program of the first day. Um, we had in Göttingen second day, you can see hands on workshops um, on um, um, neuroanatomy, microscopy. Yeah, and um, so it's very practical, as you can see here, that's usually that what we what we what we cannot get. And then a visit in the um, neuroimmunological laboratory of our colleagues, um, Christine Stadelmann, Wolfgang Brück, um, Professor Nestler. Yeah, so it's um, it's very um, it's very helpful. Um, to have this. So that is an example for, for an on-site weekend. So the nice thing is that the DIU has developed an infrastructure um, which is part of Zoom. So in Zoom you have everything, you have all slides, you have all um, the calendar for all these events, you have all recorded lectures, you have for example papers and handouts um, which are here. Um, so here you can see for example here a, a, a folder-like structure where you can get, um, for example, all um, um, all material for um, uh, for the lecturers. Here you can see, for example, the lecturers, the um, the videos of lecture uh, um, of the lectures. So even if you are not able to participate, so with this infrastructure, is it's possible to um, to follow this presentation even later on, or if you would like to. Um, um, to repeat um, something, to get um, to uh, watch a second time to a lecture, it's possible with this infrastructure. So the nice thing is, and um, that will be um, um, presented by um, Professor Funk, that the DIU has really experience in this in this um, in this lectures, which uh, in in this master courses, which uh, which are usually performed during the um, during your normal work, so um, part-time study. So if you are interested uh, about the feedback and um, first experiences from our, our um, German master course, so don't hesitate to um, um, to um, to um, read, for example, this paper. So we have published it and um, to um, demonstrate together with um, our colleagues, um, um, Christine Stadelmann and Sven Molt, who have been involved in the um, German master course as well. So here you find a very nice description of the modules and of the development. So what I, I have done um, a minute ago. So um, so in Germany we have uh, we have been successful by getting support, yeah, and we will try the same for the um, for the um, 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 for the Charcot. But I think the most important thing is. Um, for the international Chaco master course is that the Chaco society is such a strong society um, that I think it's um, it's the best choice I think to have such um, a great um, society powerful society with um, with really um, such a focus on um, um, on education and, and high quality um, educational conferences so what 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 um, Giancarlo has mentioned workshops um, so we have um, so we are looking forward to the November conference in in Barveno as well so that's why here of course with the um, European Chaco it's much better because uh, uh, because we have the Chaco foundation um, as the main institution is involved in it so um, again um, um, so what we tried in in, in Germany um, of course we have um, we have costs um, which are associated with the master course, but we tried um, with um, um, as, uh, with some um, sponsorships from the from the industry, sponsorships from hospital, and we try to reduce the um, uh, the amount so to offer scholarships to the participants. And um, same is true what we um, what we attempt for the um, international master course. Yeah, so. So I can only tell you that that um, we have really for this amount of um, education and for this high quality of speakers, 
it's in principle a cheap uh, master course if you calculate what it's really what is really um, what amount of uh, lecturers um, you have hands-on courses but of course it's a significant amount of money and that's why for example we in Dresden we are happy that our CEO is supporting us a lot and if you have a young student the hospital is supporting the student with um, this uh, tuition um, fees what we can see here so next slide um, so that's what we what is our situation in Germany so um, we, um, we we have a process um, what we would like to implement then later on for European Chaco um, uh, master course as well um, um, we have a committee which will we have as well um, and then we can um, help um, students who cannot afford um, um, the master course um, um, uh, with a full um, uh, master course fee. Okay, so next slide. Um, so we have usually one symposium where all meet in Germany. We have it on the um, on the last weekend of November. Here you can see, for example, what what we will have um, this year as well. So we um, in presence um, we. Um, um, all um, um, all colleagues and students will come, so we have, will have most of the speakers together. So with Chaco, of course, we have the Chaco Symposium as well in some, uh, in in November. That's why we don't need it. But here in Germany, we have we have installed one meeting where all um, current and old students um, can meet together to um, to celebrate and um, to discuss um, experiences and um, outcomes from our master course. Okay, so then I think it's very good um, after I have told you a little bit about our um, German experience um, uh, to hand over to um, Richard Funk. So he is, um, I know him very much because he was for a long time um, the um, chair of anatomy in my medical faculty, but um, he was always interested in, in education and that's why he is now moved. Um, because he's still very active, now moved to the DIU. And I think it was, I think it, uh, Giancarlo, it was for you as well, a very important um, um, experience um, to come to Dresden to visit really the DIU because, because really to see that it's um, an institution which is really um, part of our official um, technical university. And that's why I think, uh, um, Richard, to, to demonstrate how uh, experienced um, the DIU is in, um, um, in, uh, education, especially of course in medical education, I think it's very nice to that we have you and to introduce us a little bit into the DIU story. Okay, uh, thank you. <clears throat> Welcome to all and to Tjalf. Uh, warm thank you and uh, I will add we have the Teams platform. Uh, yeah, where we share all the data and and such uh, online presentation. Okay, uh, yes, I'm a physician too. And it at the end of the 70s, beginning 80s, I was even in a clinic of neurology working. So a long time ago, but I have the experience and I was a long time in the Senate of the TU Dresden to coordinate the scientific affairs of the medical faculty with the other faculties. Okay, just going now to the DIU. This is a university of further and continuing studies in association with the TU Dresden, Technik University Dresden. And the TU Dresden is one of the 11 German universities of excellence. And uh, because we are tightly linked to this as subsidiary company uh, with the TUDAC and as uh, associated institute of the TU Dresden, we are also uh, happy to, to have one of these excellence uh, universities uh, in the background. <clears throat> we are in principle a private university. However, we are as Associated Institute also certified by the Free State of Saxony. So we have both from both worlds the best, I would say, the flexibility of a private university. You will see it later. 
uh, how good it is to be more flexible and uh, the, let's say, renounce uh, of a, a state university. And uh, we will see that the programs of the DIU are highly interdisciplinary and they include also experienced practitioners and, uh, let's say, lecturers from even all of the world now, uh, especially in our international studies. The next, please. <clears throat> this is the history of the Dresden International University established in 2003, uh, main locations in the World Trade Center in Dresden, and uh, about 2,200 students, uh, and 30% now international students, and you will see later, we will enroll more and more international study programs. And we have about 300 German and international professors. And as I said, we are a platform university. We can also uh, look for the very best lecturers uh, anywhere where they are. We pick out such lecturers uh, if they are in Germany, Switzerland or somewhere. This is our network with companies, other institutions, museums and so on. Also the now the chip companies uh, which are around Dresden and Bosch and such uh, companies. Next please. So these are our schools, our portfolio, education, communication and culture, healthcare, engineering, medical science, business law and management, and now digital management for one year now. And the next please. And we have about 35 bachelor and master programs and much more seminars, certificate courses, and so on. Next, please. <clears throat> In medical science, we have the study programs, clinical research, ethics in medical care, healthcare management, medical law, parodontology and implant therapy, preventive medicine, and now multiple sclerosis management. Next, please. And uh, we are also, like now with Charcot, collaborating with medical societies and associations like the Deutsche Gesellschaft für Parodontologie or the German Society of Anti-Aging in the Preventive Medicine course. Next, please. And uh, as I said already, we get the stuff and we can easily hire these people and the courses can be configured in accordance to any needs, what the needs of the market, of the pupils and so on. And we have very short decision processes due to a simple organizational structure. However, it must be accredited and certified by the ministry. Now, next, please. <clears throat> so just a glimpse to our location here at the World Trade Center. Next, please. And to some rooms which were renovated in the last year. And so you have the very best surrounding. And that's why also Tjalf said, please come and visit us and you have the meeting events and so on and lecture halls, etc. So we are really happy to welcome you uh, here in Dresden at the DIO. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Professor Furka. I think uh, I have to say that uh, the level of organization that I knew when I came to Dresden, uh, it, it is a, a fundamental condition why the European Core Foundation decided to uh, to have such uh, 
uh, a master ongoing. Um, and I think that, uh, as everybody knows, a master means a university-driven activity, and it has to be a university with a solid experience in this area. That is exactly what you have shown us uh, in, in these minutes. Uh, I will try to be very fast. And next, please. Um, oh. <laughs> okay. So this is just to give you an idea about what uh, happened. We started uh, this level in 2021 to consider uh, the possibility, uh, and uh, we have discussed all the experience already collected by the German version of the master. And uh, uh, we try we try now to evolve to this international master, uh, taking advantage from uh, uh, what has been already done, which is an incredible advantage from the practical point of view in terms of organization. And at the same time, to, let's say, uh, take advantage from uh, the uh, contribution coming from uh, many different uh, scientists and researchers and clinicians uh, who are working in collaboration uh, with uh, the European Shako Foundation. Next. So, um, and here is just to give a bit you a, a very global view of the master. Um, I share with Charles the responsibility of uh, uh, director of uh, this master. The master is a structure in four semesters, that means two years of activity. Uh, there is an accreditation with the certification and quality assurance by the Institute Aquin. Uh, the study location will be distributed. Uh, there will be three main centers, uh, the Barcelona, Dresden and Milan, uh, where uh, the students will be offered practical aspects both for uh, instrumental tests and uh, what matters a lot, clinical uh, activities. Uh, it's a unique opportunity. Uh, also, there will be the possibility during this um, uh, stay at the three one of the three locations to have uh, deep knowledge about uh, some aspect of uh, pathology and anatomy. And there will be a lot of uh, 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 discussion about uh, uh, clinical practice at the three sites because we want people to be deeply uh, involved. Uh, as uh, we said, it's not just a master for physicians, it's not just for neurologists. It is a master for those who have interest in uh, multiple sclerosis. So the fundamental point is to have a university degree with 240 credits uh, that open the possibility to be involved in this type of uh, master. That's the only limitation, but of course, uh, the person has to be also in some way able to demonstrate her interest or his interest in the area of uh, multiple sclerosis and related disorders. I have to add because we will also, also uh, try to consider not only MS, but also what is at the border of MS. The degree is a degree of Master of Science uh, with uh, 60 uh, university degrees, and the tuition fee is fixed in 20,000 euros. Next, please. And a lot of people have deeply worked in, in this one and a half year. And here you see the people who have worked with us, Gilles Dan, Kazuo Fujiara, Maria Troiano, Piso Ben Sorensen, Jacqueline Palas, Xavier Montalban, Letizia Leocani, Hans Lasman, and uh, Hans Peter Hartum. These are the members of the scientific committee, but many other, many other uh, teachers are involved. Uh, uh, more than 65 uh, people will be involved in teaching activity from everywhere. Next, please. Uh, we have six modules that characterize the activity of this master. Uh, one very important aspect is that the master is for people who already have some uh, uh, 
some ongoing professional activity. So it has been organized in order to allow people to uh, to have this participation compatible with the everyday clinical or uh, other type of activities. Uh, it is a master, as I said, subdivided in six modules. Uh, again, it, this has been a bit generated by the previous experience with the German okay. master, but we have uh, quite uh, largely reviewed and uh, uh, reorganized the different type of modules, taking advantage from uh, the recommendation that we have received from also many other external consultants. For each of the module, we have some people responsible, uh, Christian Stademann and Hans Lasman for the uh, module one that is mostly on, on uh, anatomy and basic mechanisms. Uh, the module two, that is clinical and diagnostic aspect, has Xavier Montalban and Yamut Vassem uh, as a responsible for the module three, where we have a lot of uh, statistics and epidemiology and methodologies. Uh, Gilles Dan, uh, Maria Piamata, and Bernard Schipp are the coordinators. For module four, uh, is the first module of therapy here. We are particularly addressing disease-modifying therapies, and we have uh, Pierce Robinson and Hans Peter Hartung and Kazuo Fujiara. Module two is more in, uh, in rehab and other type of intervention, symptomatic treatment, and you have Letizia Locani, Peter Flachnecker, and Liliana Patrucco. And module six is based on monitoring and documentation and some practical aspects, including the final thesis. And Maria Troiano and Jacqueline Pallas are responsible of this sixth module. Next, please. And here you see uh, the distribution of credits in for the different type of uh, uh, sectors and also how they are distributed in the four semesters. The first semester will deal with the theoretical principles and clinical and diagnostic aspects, 15 credits. Again, 15 credits uh, always for each semester, then also for the second semester, studies and statistics and therapy one. Uh, third semester, therapy two, monitoring and documentation, and the uh, semester four is uh, dedicated to the master thesis. And here during the master thesis also, there will be the possibility for students to spend the period in some of the connected institutes and, and MS centers. Next, please. So, as I said, it is a two-year program, and the onset of activity will be uh, next November. And uh, uh, as a consequence, we will complete the first master in November 2024. Both the onset at the end will take place in combination with the annual meeting of the European Shoko Foundation, which is also a part of the teaching activities, I have to say. We have decided to have a small uh, number of uh, people participating uh, because we want to facilitate the one-to-one -one interaction. There will be, we estimate there will be three, more than three teachers for each student. So I can say a uh, unique, really, condition in terms of uh, university classes. Uh, English will be our, uh, um, um, our principal language. And uh, the, uh, uh, as you know, the problem is that we have discussed a lot if to accept already in the first, uh, in the first edition of this master people from outside Europe. Uh, in principle, we have more consideration for people, for students coming from Europe, but exceptionally, we will also consider some uh, uh, students coming from uh, outside Europe. This is because uh, we have some periods to be spent in Europe, as we said, in Barcelona, in Dresden, and in Milan. And that's, of course, implies some co additional costs. Uh, the Central European time will be the reference time for all the activities. And there are a lot of different uh, forms of educational activity, in class teaching, interviews with experts, journal clubs, 
conferences of cases, very important aspect, very practical aspect. But also, uh, we will use uh, congresses, particularly the Actress Congress and the annual meeting of the Shoko, in order to uh, to try to expose students to some selected activities. We will define the specific uh, uh, activities that the, the, the students have to follow in, in this type of condition. Uh, a lot of practical training, uh, as I told you, uh, that's uh, something very important for technical aspects, but also for clinical uh, training. And uh, the uh, central role of the uh, hospitals and MS centers uh, are, really, uh, are really there, and the three uh, units that are involved, Barcelona, Dresden and Milan, uh, I have to say, are among the uh, more advanced units uh, for multiple sclerosis. Uh, uh, here we, uh, we, we have to consider that uh, the, there will be a, a very important uh, collaboration with the entire board of the European Charcot Foundation. What we mean here? Well, we mean that uh, the, all the uh, educational power of the European Charcot Foundation, we have more than 200 uh, really recorded uh, lectures and debates and topics that will be available. So uh, you will be offered these extra uh, information uh, coming from uh, the collected activities, something uh, very important, uh, I think. Uh, 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 please consider that the, uh, the 20,000 will include also registration for the activities uh, and the presence at different meetings, but it does include the travel and the accommodation. So, uh, of course, uh, still it is possible for uh, some students maybe to find some uh, uh, solution also for travel and accommodation, but they are not part of the uh, uh, regular activity of the master. Next, please. How it will run the uh, educational activity? Well, we will have uh, weekly online live session uh, using Zoom, and we have already decided that the time of this uh, every week activities will take place from 19 to 22 o'clock in the evening. Again, just to allow all of you who are might be clinical activity or other uh, activities on boys during the day uh, to have this master compatible with uh, these type of activities. There will be approximately 12 online weekend blocks uh, and uh, uh, we'll also have some Friday and Saturday online sessions. So it is a dance program, of course, that has to try to utilize all the free time, but we will also uh, build everything in order to give you some breath. So don't be too much worried. <laughs> we will not destroy you. <laughs> uh, uh, the, uh, the activities that uh, have um, uh, consisting in these blocks are here listed. The first one will be the opening, the opening that will coincide with the annual meeting in uh, Baveno. And this year in Baveno, the topic will be uh, progressive MS, so something very, very hot, I have to say. Uh, then uh, we will have in Germany in March next year uh, the first uh, practical clinical activity, clinical visit including here some uh, aspects or some teaching activities uh, for uh, uh, pathology and pathophysiology. So it will be a combination of, of uh, module one uh, and module two activities in some way. Then in uh, May 2023, uh, the students will shift uh, to Barcelona 
these are the times where all the students are all together. And uh, in Barcelona, the, uh, the, the meeting will be focused uh, on uh, diagnostic aspects, monitoring aspects, and on the, some, uh, again, clinical practical aspects. Then the, uh, in Italy, in the occasion of the visit in 2023, uh, it, we will have in Milan an, an activity that will be concentrated on some uh, uh, aspect of uh, uh, neurophysiology uh, and mostly about uh, rehabilitation and symptomatic management and symptomatic phenomenology. And the last common activity where, again, all the students come together will be uh, at the end when the thesis has to def be defended. Uh, and it will happen again in coincidence with the November annual meeting of the European Shakur Foundation. So again, we have a lot of virtual activity, but in five occasions, all the students will met together with the teachers. So again, this is a quite good uh, combination, I have to say. Next one, please. OK, so uh, those of you who are, who are interested and we already have received a lot of uh, pre-registration, please send your curriculum, a letter of motivation, the school and the university transcript and the scholarship application form that you can be uh, can you can download at this uh, address that you see here so how it will be the selection the selection will be assigned to the organizing committee uh, and uh, to the scientific uh, some components of the scientific committee and uh, they will just operate uh, trying to select those who have more highly motivated, uh, 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 let's say, reasons to, to be involved. For those who will not succeed, don't be afraid. This is only the first master, then it will take place annually. So they will receive a, a, a bit of uh, uh, favorite uh, pre-consideration for the next master. Next, please. So this uh, is the, 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 the timeline that uh, will precede the onset of the, uh, uh, of the master activities. Uh, so uh, in, uh, in occasion of the exams in Amsterdam, please, those who are, who are interested and those uh, that you know may be interested may come and to visit the e European Shako Foundation booth where we have a pre-registration available. So it is a way to really very quickly to manifest the interest to be involved in the master. Uh, the uh, deadline for uh, this application will be end of October, and uh, we will uh, um, decide about those who uh, have to be uh, selected for the first 20 uh, students uh, uh, group. It will happen really very early. It will be uh, very first week of November so that you can just uh, give time to all of you to uh, register and then to come to the European Shako Foundation. As I said, uh, the registration here is, is completely free for the students that have been selected. Uh, of course, uh, all the students have to uh, follow the uh, recommended activities that we have just listed, uh, at least 75% uh, uh, of the activities have to be com completed in order then to have the possibility to uh, discuss uh, the thesis and then to have uh, at the end of the master. 
So that's something that uh, we must really have in mind. And uh, November 16 will be the first time we will meet all together. Those who will, uh, will be selected will be uh, will receive the information about the modality uh, to start this activity. Next, please. Now, really uh, very, very quick because we already have discussed a lot about this point here. Again, a bit the overview of uh, the different activities, only to just to reinforce the concept that uh, in the module one, uh, we have the opening that will take place uh, in occasion of the European Pro Foundation. For module two, we have activities in Dresden and in Barcelona, March and May. Next. Next. This is just the distribution, just to give you a bit an idea about uh, the uh, here, just only one point here. Uh, always when we have a, a given activity, half of the time is spent as a contact time, so is spent in teaching activity, uh, but then a double time is spent in order to try to, to, to realize what is the self-study. So it's one to two ratio, the amount of time that has to be uh, spent on this point of view. And that can be seen here for all the different uh, type of activities. Uh, all the details, this is module one, this is module two, will be available. We have now we are now in the final phase of the confirmation of all the different teachers. So the program with all the teachers will be uh, disseminated uh, uh, at the actives. So you will see also this uh, very incredible a uh, large number of uh, top uh, uh, top teachers for this activity. Next, please. You see here number three and number four. As you see here, uh, in the Milano in uh, uh, in occasion of the exercise will be the uh, next uh, the third time where people will meet in person with uh, the uh, teachers, and uh, and uh, the, this will take place during uh, the module three and four activities. Next, please. And, the thumb, and this is just, again, the type of activities uh, with the different credits uh, that uh, and can may give you a bit of global idea, but you will have much more details because for each of these uh, different uh, course, uh, we have also more details about the content of the courses. Next. And these are the final module five and six. Uh, and again, as I said, the final one will be again in Milan, but just for uh, the, the, the uh, attribution of the uh, of the master. And don't forget that we have a lot of oral examinations. We have we try to uh, have a continuous interaction in order to uh, try to maintain a high level of participation uh, to the activities of the master. Next, please. This is just, uh, again, what may happen, uh, what will happen in the Model 6. Uh, as you see, there will be also activities like uh, teaching activities like a social medical aspect, health economy aspects, patient reported outcomes, he health. So, I, I mean, again, it is a quite, really quite, uh, very, very uh, in-depth uh, teaching activity concerning all the aspects of MS. Next. Uh, so, I mean, this is uh, the master thesis. That is the final time is the sixth module with the 15 credits that complete the master activity. Next. Okay, I think I I think I had not too much uh, 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 oppress you with all this uh, information. I see my dear friend, you, Castle, Castling, you. It's a pleasure to see you, uh, uh, one of our teacher, and uh, really uh, is the time for some uh, question. If uh, any question, we have today with us uh, possible students. We have. Uh, 
possible pharma companies supporting the program. Um, so anyone has question to arise? Uh, I think we have a perfect time, 10 minutes left for uh, any question or comment. Uh, Charles, first, could you please maybe uh, add some final consideration about the goals? Oh, uh, I think uh, Charles didn't get the, the sentence because yeah, sorry, sorry. Uh, te yeah, te technical problems yeah. at, at I was the moment. Thrown out. Ask them. Carlo. Yeah, sorry. Only that you give some uh, final remarks. Yeah. So yeah. So thank you very much. Um, um, so I think it was a great overview. So you can see from a from a uh, from a start um, um, which we had um, together with a strong partner, the DIU. What you have said. Now I think um, with the optimal um, 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 organization in charge, the European Charcot Foundation, to offer really. The, the best education, what we have, the best speakers, and um, I can, yeah, I can, I can only say that it's really um, a, a dream um, for um, for people who would like to um, specialize in multiple sclerosis, especially then a small group where you can exchange with your international colleagues, um, so you get really um, information in different formats. Yeah, so. I think I would. Um, uh, yeah, I think we would be very happy if um, this um, concept, um, which um, Giancarlo um, and the team um, developed together with me in the in the past months, um, if it's uh, if it would be attractive to you, and if he, uh, yeah, if our presentation was, um, um, yeah, positive in that way that you recognize, okay, I would like to um, increase my knowledge in multiple sclerosis. I have to go for Chaco MSN. Yeah, thank you. We, do, do we have questions? In the chat, we have questions. Okay. Sorry, I have also one question. Yeah. Uh, um, is there a possibility to may, maybe start a kind of mini project from the first semester? And can a student be involved in uh, those projects uh, from the first semester with uh, teachers and uh, from different MS centers? What do you mean as a project? Because yeah. t here uh, uh, all the activities are largely predefined. Then, of course, uh, as I said, uh, maybe that someone has no, uh, let's say, commitment, and uh, some student maybe uh, would like to spend the entire master in a, a given location and where uh, during the day, the student may have a personal type of uh, research or clinical activity, but, but the master has a predefined specific profile, except the final thesis. Yeah. 15 credits, six months to spend, where the student has to, what, what you just asked for is exactly what has to happen in the second year when, uh, together, the scientific direction, you can divide the choice of uh, your final uh, thesis and the topic. And uh, here at that point, uh, at this point, we really uh, need to listen to what are your interests and then to uh, offer you the different possible alternatives and then to see. So this final thesis can be just, uh, you know, a theoretical aspect, uh, but it could be also a research aspect. And the search can be clinical or basic, as always, for the thesis. So it depends a bit also on the amount of time you have free for to dedicate to the thesis, of course. Yeah, and. Thanks, and uh, I, I meant just a research project. I mean, the mini project like literature review or uh, when someone interested in something like this to to in, in MS. Uh, feel them I meant, but uh, thank you for your answer. No, no, it's clear what you ask. Uh, it is an important aspect and we have already discussed this point because, of course, if the student come to the master without other pending commitments, 
then of course you may take advantage to in, in the meantime that you are involved in the master also to uh, to to be involved in some specific search uh, lines so we have a network of incredible different labs and centers that are able to accommodate the person but it depends really on, on the your availability in some way hello everyone Thanks. can i interrupt can I ask a question? Yes, of yes. course. Yeah. Hello, everyone. It's it's a brilliant opportunity. I think it's really, really good. And my question is, uh, if you already have got a master's degree, can you have a second master? And then uh, is there an age limit? And um, how long does it take to visit Dresden and uh, Milan hospitals? Is it like a day event or a couple of days? And can you choose the the last thesis when you write down the, the final sort of project after you've done all the models? So can you choose the theme or you're being given by the by the teachers? How, how does that work? Yes, yeah, so uh, do uh, can you listen to me? Yes. Yeah. 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 Because teams, I don't see anything. So in, in my, so um, probably, um, of course, if we go to a city or to a center, of course, it should not be just for a day. So we would try to make a dense program. I would say, so our experience is usually three days because then you can see all specialities there. You can get you get the hands-on training, and then probably we can combine it. Um, um, so, for example, in, in, in Milan, we will combine it probably with the Barveno meeting, yeah, so that traveling is reduced or we could combine a meeting with Actrum so that traveling is not so complex. Then regarding the topic of, uh, of the master thesis, of course, it's up to you. So during your um, study time, you have a lot of, um, um, a lot of interesting uh, researchers and scientists, and it's of course up to you to decide. But on the other side, of course, Giancarlo and me, we are there to assist if if there is if you don't know what to choose. So we have done it, for example, in the German course. So most of the um, community, they had already an, an experience um, uh, or an idea what to do. But um, so it's up to you. But of course, we would offer support um, to find the right seasons. And if you have already and if you already have a master's degree, are you overqualified for this no. program or you're no, still a because, because we have, for example, some students they had have, for example, an MBA already. Mm -hmm. yeah, because because I think the big problem is, I think, to offer education, I think it's good. But to have education with, without a degree is not as nice. So if you would say we have a two years program without anything at the end, I think it I think it would not be as successful. And that's why. I think you can, mm -hmm. or uh, I, I think you can have a second one because that is really very much topic related, and there should yeah. be not a, lo a lot of overlap to other masters uh, master courses because that is really, as Giancarlo has shown it to you, that's really unique, and there's nothing which which is taken from other master courses because this has been hundred percent developed for multiple sclerosis and uh, and um, um, similar diseases. Concerning Thank you the, very much. Concerning the age limitation, yes, we have an age limitation. It's 90 years old. <laughs> <Not zero. laughs> Carlo, very good. Yeah. <laughs> Jürgen, we have the... the, 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 the if I can't... Jürgen. If I can't... There's a bit of echo. Well, well, uh, Arte, that's my... Oops. Yeah. Am I still on? No, perfect. No, go, that's, go. that's perfect. Go, Jurg. Now it's okay. fine. Jurg, please ask the question. Can, can, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Perfectly. Yeah. Perfectly. I just wanted to say a word of recommendation because I know uh, Extremes well and I know uh, the Sharko Foundation well and this new master course. And I only can recommend the uh, level of the teaching and the level of discussions is so good 
and I can judge that because I had the opportunity to follow it on both sides. And my congratulations just go to the two of you, Giancarlo, as always, and Charles, uh, since a few years, that you bring these initiatives together. And that is what we need from the patient's point of view and from the view of those who want to become specialists in this difficult disease, multiple sclerosis. So congratulations from my side. And if I can be of any support, you know, you always can count on me. Oh, thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. And we will use you a lot. <laughs> Okay, I think uh, we are at the end of our time. I hope that uh, we have been able to give you a bit a global view about this master. Uh, I would like to ask now Charles just to close the session. Yeah, so um, thank you very much that you um, have to be, uh, that you joined us for this hour. I hope we were able to show you um, the nice and very important project I think it's really um, a very strong project for you, for your education, um, to spend two years in part time, really with the best um, speakers in the in the field of neuroimmunology. We especially planned this event before Actrums because um, Giancarlo and me, together with the European Charcot Foundation, will be around, and that's why I think it will be um, quite easy to get uh, to get in touch with us. That's why we wanted to um, announce it um, before Actrim's time. And we hope um, that we will find uh, an interesting audience, interesting 20 master students for the pioneering first um, um, Chaco MSM matricle. And I think Giancarlo, I can I can speak for you as well. I think we, we really look forward because, because this type of education to have a master's in this field, it's, it's really great. And, and that's why don't hesitate to contact us, the DIU, um, so you have information. We are very happy to answer um, uh, questions like we have done before. Yeah, and um, that's why I wish you um, a very nice evening. Thank everybody um, for the participation. And um, yeah, Giancarlo, me and the DIU team, we look forward um, to welcome you. Bye to everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.